Welcome to Caveman Bricks, Builds, and More. I am the Caveman, and then way over here, hiding behind the box, Hello. is Dragon J Boy Gaming. Uh, we have the box out because this is part two of our video of building Lego set and 759. We will be building our dad's house as well. Um, this is Lego set 75969. Uh, Hogwarts Astronomy Tower. This is the newest part of the big castle piece. Um, not the big castle. We built the big castle. But this is the minifigure size castle that they have uh, that all hooks together. Uh, we've already done the Lumping Willow. We've already done bags one, two, and three of this set. Bags one, two, and three we had a lot of trouble with. If you haven't seen part one yet, please go check it out. We accidentally, we built it. We accidentally deleted the video. We rebuilt it, the video messed up, so we rebuilt it a third time. I'm gonna go ahead and move the box out of the way, and it's you can see, yeah, this is what we did in part one. We've got the four minifigs, we've got Hedwig, we've got the greenhouse, and we've got the base of the castle. Today, it looks like we're going to finish off this big, huge tower section uh, in bags four, five, and six, and get the rest of the minifigures. So uh, after we're done, we're going to do a review here at the end. And then we will be done with this set. Um, if you want to see it, bless you, if you want to see it unboxed, uh, make sure to check out part one. That's where the we unboxed it. The real part one. The fake part one. Yeah, the fake part one because actually the, the box is already open. Yeah. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and pull out the instructions. And then four, five, and six. Whoa! And things went flying. I'm going to put the box off to the I side. Found it. Yep, that was the uh, brick separator. Okay. And Judah, I'm going to ask you to hang on to the greenhouse and the, the minifigures. I think we're going to need the castle, but hang on to it for now. There's bag six, bag five, bag four, our extra pieces. And we have a few more. We actually have quite a few stickers left. We haven't used very many of our stickers in the first three bags. But, uh, look where I placed Hedwig. Oh, it's an interesting spot. I think we're going to have an Owlery. So once we're done, I think we're going to have an actual spot to put Hedwig. Maybe not. We had that last time. Maybe you're right. Maybe it was in the Wompy Willow. Okay. Bag four, we're going to get Hermione and Neville. Wait, then we're going to get multiple Hedwigs and multiple Harry and multiple and multiple. What are you talking about? Multiple. Think about it. Almost every set comes with um a Hedwig. Mm. I mean a Harry. Yeah. Ooh, red looking pumpkin piece. Yeah, we discussed that in our first video. Yeah, I think you're right. Where's Hermione's head? Yeah, I don't have all the bags open yet. Uh, how is this? Neville. Why didn't Draco do the exact same thing so he would be in the slug party? I think he's a little proud. Also, he was on a secret mission from a bad person in this movie. Who? <gasps> Lord Voldemort! Lord Voldemort! Okay. Do you have all the pieces? think so. I'm missing the hair. You're missing some hair, okay? I'm missing some hair. Here's Hermione's hair. It looks so similar. I don't see Neville's hair. Oh, oh here it is, right here. It has a stud in it. That's why I didn't see it. Okay. Also, Dad, I found something that looks quite that would that is actually pretty funny. Can I go get it to show you? What? It's um a Disney character. No, not right now. It's part of it. What do you think is so funny? I'll get it. Why don't you tell me? No, it's a surprise. Okay, go quick. Okay. I'm gonna keep building here. I think I'm building a table. table though. Okay, I'm coming back. Oh. 
You think that's gonna work? It's gonna. It works. So, um, lavender came with a um, hairpiece that has two holes in it. One. Um, it can have it back. Yeah, one on the front, one on the back. And uh, the back is where you put the bow. So Judah went and got the hat off of one of the ducks from Disney, one of Donald's nephews, and put it on her to see if it would go. And it does, apparently. Because um, it's certain hairs have like these certain holes yeah. in it for like, for, like accessories. Yeah. I don't know why they changed it up, though. I don't know why either. Like, couldn't they just make the um, accessory accessories on the hair? I don't know, buddy. Couldn't they just put the accessories on the hair? They could, but then you couldn't customize them as much, I guess. Uh, that's true, but why do they only do it to specific pieces? If they're going to do it to, like, some, why not do it to old land? I lost the bow. Oh, no. It has a... Oh, yep. Found it. Found it. Good. Hello, little people. Okay. You think this is a table? Yes. Am I right? I have no idea. Oh, yeah, it is. Here we are on the next page. We're going to put cookies and cupcakes on it. <laughs> like... No, it's not. <gasps> the chocolate fondue. Oh yeah. yeah gangster. The chocolate gangster mon much gangster. Oh my buddy. Okay. I'm gonna get this. Anyways, I'm gonna put this back. If you haven't checked out the Disney Castle videos, we are completely done building the Disney Castle, so go check that out. We just recently uploaded the um, speed build video from it, so that is fun and exciting. These look kind of like waffles. I think in another set, maybe the burrow, we had these and they were waffles. But I think on here they're supposed to be cookies. Neville is ready. Okay, Judah, help me make some uh, cupcakes. We need I want six a of chocolate them. fondue. Well, we're working on it. I'm making the chocolate. Just grab a cupcake thing and a stick. <laughs> chocolate. It's. It's. Oh, wait. Are you sure that this is cupcake yes. frosting? <laughs> it's cupcake frosting. It does kind of look like poop. <laughs> <laughs> So I guess that that could be a good, if you're looking for poop pieces, this is a good set. A lot of poop pieces, that is. I was trying not to say poop, but like, then again, that's the only... But they're definitely little cupcakes, so we've got uh, waffles and jelly-filled cookies, and then the cupcakes, and then the glasses... Oh, here. this is an accessory for an apple. Oh, here. yeah? I must have missed that. Yep, you're right, with a glass on it. Oh, okay, can I see a glass? Yep, here you go. <clears throat> this, the, it's not like butterbeer? Well, no, it's empty. I think, and I'm not certain on this, but I think that the uh, newest minifigures is the first time we've had a butterbeer glass. So if you want to see that, make sure to check out minifigures part four. And here is Neville. Okay, and here's the chocolate fountain. It's pretty cool. Okay, so that's just gonna sit off to the side for right now. Now hey, start. I thought you said I would make this. Oh, well, you were busy with Neville. Wait, the chocolate 
went into the table? The peg for it did for sure. There, there's a leak in this, guys. There's a leak. Call a plumber. Call a plumber. Somebody call a plumber, okay? I don't think you'd call a plumber for well, we an Luigi came today. Yeah, we had some plumbers visit our house today, didn't we? Luigi. I mean, Mario visited today. No kid. Mario and Luigi, actually. Mario. And if you guys didn't know, Mario wasn't originally a superhero. I don't think he was ever a superhero. He did. And okay. Remember... Him saving Pete from Bowser in it? And yeah. Everything? That's yeah. a superhero move. Oh, okay. He's a superhero. But he actually used to just be a plumber, and I yeah. guess, like, Bowser was, like, some germ or something. What was mm. Bowser originally before he became a supervillain? A giant lizard? In the sewers? Uh, no. Uh... I think the story is, is that Mario went to a different world through the pipes. What? No. So he was like just doing his plumbing business and then he accidentally fell through the pipes somehow, which doesn't make any sense. Mm -hmm. And guys, I figured out how to attach the greenhouse to the castle. Yes, we're not there yet. I'm but. doing it. Okay. I want to do it. Bam. The greenhouse is now attached properly. It's probably going to do it at the end of the booklet or so. Probably. That would be my guess. Thanks so much. Do you put your clothes on backwards and your arms on backwards or something? I think we're going to be done with bag three pretty quickly. Or, Ooh. or bag four, I'm sorry. This is bag four. Powerful. Powerful. Okay. Who's left? Who's left? Who's left? Who's the, the last mini finger? I think Draco. And someone else. A yellow hair. Oh, Luna? Oh, ew. Good dad? Yeah. I, we are a um, Hogwarts house. I am a Hufflepuff, which I have to admit, it really suits me. I would prefer to be a Gryffindor, though. Yeah. I love my Hogwarts house. Ravenclaw? Yep. Yeah. They're known for being smart. Yeah. I'm a Ravenclaw through and through. In fact, instead of having an actual code, they, ha they have to solve a riddle to get into their house. Yes, into their common room. Yes. Yeah. This is true. Something that actually happens in the books, but doesn't happen in the movies. So, Dad, name one riddle that they named. They only do one. You only see the Ravenclaw common room once. You never see the Hufflepuff. You see Slytherin once. Oh, yeah, because they're trying to sneak in. Yeah. Do you remember what book it was that you see the Slytherin common room? Um, book two? Yes, book two. That's right. And you see the Ravenclaw common room in book seven. You see, uh, you don't see the Hufflepuff common room, but they do talk about Wait, why its did location. they enter the Ravenclaw? Uh, they were looking for the lost diadem of Rowena Ravenclaw. Oh, you mean that little crane? The crown, yes. Cr 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 cr
guys. Guys, we we are actually. I is weird. Like we are the perfect Hogwarts family because like yes. Mama's a Gryffindor. We already have that common room. Yep. Dad, you're Ravenclaw. We're building that currently. Yes. Room. Yeah, we're gonna build the Ravenclaw common room. In and this I th one. and my prediction is in each four in each four of these because we have four if I'm correct. I think so. That sounds right. Um. Once we're done, then. With them, each one of them will have a different. So, like, our next one may have a griff, ha, may have a Slytherin common room, and then mine, and then the one after that may have a Hufflepuff common room, yeah. or the other way around. Hey, what anybody want one? Hey, now what are you doing here? You didn't get invited. Well, you see. Oh. Yo, Slughorn, I want to be part of the party. <laughs> Sorry, but you can't. You are not worthy to be in a slug party. Yeah, that's... Oh, yay. Well, I am worthy to be in it. In fact, no, you are not. Okay, fine. I'll be a slave in it. Not a slave. A servant. A servant in it. So I can still be in it, but also so I'm. I, oh, but also. So so you can have someone to do it. Do all your work. Good idea. Take this. Put on the uniform. Okay, I think I'm happened. making the Chinese okay. lantern right now. Yep. With a pumpkin. Yeah. Ah. Yeah. That's how it happened. No, that's not. Slughorn, Neville's in the party. Wait, what? Really? You're not invited. <laughs> oh, anyways, I will be taking this. E. Thank you. Oh, but that was my only cup. Hey. Too bad. So here are these kind of Chinese lanterns, which the Chinese. are pretty cool. Then you're going to go. And they use pumpkins. Oh, I didn't see that part. What? what? Supposed to be these things. Did you miss something? Yep. There we go. Judah is the best. He never misses it. Mm. Okay. And then this is going to go in here. Like that. Okay. And it says that those can't be extra pieces. What okay. is that? These go right what? here. What is that? Just some doors? I guess, yeah. Okay. So what is these the are extra pieces. What is doing? Everyone, I'm so worthy to be in this. Okay. All right. We are going on to bank five. And in bank five, we get. Luna Lovegood, who was Harry's date to the party. And who else? That's it, just Wait, Luna. Wait, they need a date? Wait, mm -hmm. what about Draco? Draco wasn't invited, remember? I know, but also he was um, in this bag. Because no, he's not... in bag six, I think. But you said we're not going to get a character in bag six. Well, I guess I was wrong. I guess it's bag five is Luna, bag six is Draco. However, Luna doesn't have a wand for some reason. What? Can you double check? I'm looking at the picture. What color wand would she have? I don't know, actually. I don't know that we have a Luna with a wand. Oh, but I see some Ravenclaw colors, so this must be when we're going to add some Ravenclaw stuff. And this is also the student of Ravenclaw? Yes, Luna is a Ravenclaw. Ooh, it has um UV. It has UV spotlight on it. Oh, that's cool. Whenever you, you shine it under a light, it lights up, Dad. Look at this. Oh, yes, it's got some shine. Yeah. And it, wait, do we even have a Luna in general? Yes, we have a couple from the... Wait. 
She's in the series one bag and the series two. I'm pretty sure that one, all those minifigures did come with a wand. I'm not sure that Luna did. Remember in the series one bag, she, maybe she has a wand, but she came with the quibbler, which is her family's newspaper. And then in the series two bag, she has her hair and she has a big lion piece from cheering at the Quidditch match. <laughs> Go Lions! Well, that would be Gryffindor. She was cheering Aww. on Gryffindor. Go okay. Okay, right now, I'm going to put on sticker mm. number... I'm going to put on sticker number three, and this is the Time Turner sticker for the piece that is in Slughorn's kind of living quarters. And this time turner thing, this timekeeper, this hourglass, is a really cool piece of magic because if the conversation is really interesting, the time, the sands don't fall as quickly, but if the conversation's really boring, then the sands go faster. I thought you it was the other way around. No, because if it's boring, you want it to be done sooner. So it starts moving faster. Oh, so Slughorn is using that for protection. Oh, no, that's smart. Yeah. Even though Slughorn doesn't know. Oh, right? No, he knows. Yeah. He knows that Harry wants something from him. Oh, I... He figures it out, but that has nothing to do with the timekeeper thing. So wait, the conversation has to end no matter what? Well, it's just a way of saying, you know, like, okay, I've got an hour to talk to you. And then if it's not interesting at all, the hour goes by quicker because the sand is moving faster. But if it's really interesting, then the sand will move slower so you have more time to talk to them. Oh, so it can, like, um, change time? Not change time, just change how it measures time. Oh, it can change the speed of time? No, just how it measures it. So it's it's lying. Imagine if you had like an egg timer and you know you twist it to make it go faster sometimes. No. Well, I have to show you sometime what I'm talking about. Anyways, activate shield mode. Sing. Shield mode, huh? Look. Aya! Backwards. Dad, look. Oh, yeah. There's been many a karate movie where they've done that same thing. It's like, oh, I want a battle. Booy, 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 booy. Huh? There's a fight. Ah, my turn to join! Yeah, 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 somebody was using it as a bottle. And, and also the brown pieces are a bit more frittle, so... Yes, so we don't want to bang them. Yeah, I'm just gonna try to break it. I'm just joking. Imagine if someone's like, ah, and then like, oh no, I didn't do it! That would be bad. Oh, not being wands? No? What do you mean? In like Attack of the Burrow. They use them oh, as knitting. Yes, for knitting needles. Yeah, you're right. Okay. Alright, we're gonna work.
work on Slughorn's office here. We're gonna put some books here. So we got two stickers. They're exactly the same. They're both gonna go down inside of this to make it look like a little bookcase. Brighter or brown than I was expecting. How many likes, likes does the um? Ask me after most, this one. Oh, I was gonna ask how many likes does our most popular video have? Hmm, I don't know. Quite a few. Not anywhere near a thousand. If we could get a thousand likes, that would be awesome. On one video, at least. Yes. So if we would could also do the Lego Dimension gameplay. Okay. Green bottle on top of this one. Then the silver chalice on top of this one. So in the instructions, these look pretty brown, but compared to the brown, they look pretty orange. Don't you think that those are kind of orangey looking? Yeah, they look the exact same. Your eyes are getting old. I don't think so. Old man. I don't think so. They're getting pretty old, old man. They're getting pretty old, old man. They're getting pretty old, old man. Bum, 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 look, we got another letter. Bum, bum, ba -da -da. Oh, we'll have to stock up on letters for a tap for the um. Private drive. Yes. And put that part of our like Diagon Alley. That would be cool if they yeah. made like Diagon Alley sets where you took like different buildings. And did what with them? And like could put them together just like this. Like you have the main part, but then you could get different building sets like. So what they call that is modulars, and they did it with, I think, City, I'm not sure, but they did a whole bunch of modulars, and you can buy the modulars, and you can hook them together in different What's ways. What's modular? Well, it's what you're talking about, where you have different buildings all put together. For the Diagon Alley? Well, not for Diagon Alley, they did it for a different thing, but there's been a lot of people hoping that they will do it for Diagon Alley. Yeah, that would be cool because I don't think it comes with wizards, wheezes, wheezes. We'll have to look, huh? If I don't think it comes with that, right? I don't know. We'll have to look. Hey, Dad. No. Okay, I'm just kidding. That doesn't fit. What do you mean it doesn't fit? I think that this is supposed to be in one like that. And then that fits. There we go. And okay, the I know exactly where to put this now. Where to put Slow what? Corn. My booty is ready to be set down. I've been staying for so long. There's actually quite a few scenes in this book, or in this movie, in this room of Professor Slughorn's. Um, there's a scene where uh, Harry tries to get Slughorn to spill his secret and he won't. There's a scene where um, Harry needs help from Professor Slughorn to uh, cure Ron of a love potion. And then there's a scene where, okay, the same know. scene where Ron almost dies, and Harry has to save him. Wait, so who put the love potion on Ron? They weren't trying to do it on Ron, they were trying to do it on Harry, and Ron didn't know that the candies were jinxed, and so he ate some of Harry's candies and fell for the love potion. Oh, Harry knew that the candies were jinxed? Uh, no, he didn't. So, 
However, the girl that they were from, Harry knew, was trying to jinx him. But Ron didn't. Oh, so who was it? I don't remember her name. You got three girl suspects. It's none of the girls that are at the party. So, you must tell us where you were, what you were doing, and and who you were with. With. Yes. Who was that? This girl. This girl. Lavender. Lavender. Lavender Brown is her name. I was in the library. Oh, I think this is the Ravenclaw room because we're building, it looks like Ravenclaw beds. Ooh, beds. Yep. not in this part of the castle anyway. Or right now, anyway. Yeah. And how could you be with Ron when he was jinxed? So why were they trying to jinx Harry? Because they wanted Harry to fall in love with him. Why? Because he's the chosen one. But don't they realize that's how Voldemort was made? <laughs> I don't think that they do. I think that that's something that only Dumbledore and Harry really know. That, um... Voldemort's mom put a love potion on his dad, so yes. there, there was never... Love. Right, that is correct. So, yeah, that's kind of how Voldemort was moved. You are right. So, wait, why did the mom want the dad, is my question. Um, he was rich and popular and things she, like that. So she was a gold digger? Kind of. She wasn't really after his money, just his... Looks. Well, she just wanted to be loved by somebody that had money and, and influence and things like that. Because she didn't have any of that. Her family used to, but they don't anymore. What happened? I don't know how they lost everything. Wow, so dramatic. From having everything to nothing. Yep happens sometimes. Sometimes people think that they're just entitled to stuff and so they stop working for it and eventually the money runs out. Oh, so and they're not doing a retirement plan? Kind of, yeah. They're not? <sighs> okay. Ooh, we're going to put stickers on both sides of this one. So on one side, we're going to put sticker number two. On the other side, we're going to put sticker number six. I don't think I've ever done double-sided stickers before. Wait, I just realized people at a nursery home... Wouldn't, nursing home? Nursing home? Uh-huh. Wouldn't they have to be there 24-7? Mm, pretty much. Like all day and then they could leave at night? They don't ever get weekends off. No, they went, that's well. That's where they live instead of living at a house. Why did you bring that up? Were, I don't know. It just came into my mind. Oh, okay. But like the people who work there, like at the stand. oh no, they just have different shifts. Oh, okay, that's good. 
to know that they um, don't get to see their family, that they still get to f see their family. Yeah. Okay. Oh, that's right. I was in the greenhouse. Hmm. And who were you with? No. He was my baby while I was watering the plants. Neville does love the greenhouse. As a matter of fact, once he was done at Hogwarts, um, and the battle of Hogwarts was over and stuff, he became the herbology teacher. Whoa! Neville, you go! You go live your dream! That's nice to hear. Wait, so... Do you think that this is the base of the big tower here? Maybe. 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 Almost done with bag five, which will leave us with just bag six. Which we will do in part three. Okay, I'm just joking. I'm just joking. I'm just joking. I'm just joking. Hey guys, there will be a link in the description to part one right here. Here, here, here. I don't know that that's accurate. We've had issues making that work. But we will oh. try. Yes. We will try to make a link in the description right here with the little corner that I am pointing Ooh, a to. a green book. And guys, what, comment okay, down hang below on. if you like chocolate. What is this green like book? The green book's going to get sticker number seven. This is our second sticker number seven. Here you go. Can, I think it's also a potions book, but it's green instead. I'm guessing, oh yeah, that it's a potion book. Then look, it gets number 10 as well. That book. Yeah. So rather that's a fortune teller book or it's a potion book. Oh, it may be um, the um, book you need for um, the reading the future class. I forgot what it's called. Divination. Oh. Divination. Oh. With Professor Chorwani. Chorwani? Chorwani. Chorwani? That's cool. Chorwani? Okay. And that goes in here. That's a cool piece. Alright. I'm getting pumped up. Because this is how you get pumped up. I don't think anyone does, Judy. <laughs> I don't know what I'm... I don't even know what's happening. Yeah, I don't know what's happening. Okay, this is going to go here. This is going to go on here. Here, 
Okay, where, oh, the Daily Prophet is also going to go in here. So we got another Daily Prophet, The Boy Who Lived tile, and it's also going to go into this bookcase thing. Okay, so those are our extra pieces. And we are on to the last bag of this. No, they watch them. I'm pretty sure they're just subscribing to be nice, but don't actually watch our videos. No, they watch them. How do you know? I'm joking! I'm joking! You got okay. it! Ooh, look at the bright silver piece, Judah. <gasps> Mine! Mine yours. I'm gonna guess it goes to the gyroscope, maybe? Or maybe the telescope. Okay, I know that that's Draco's hairpiece. Okay, here's his torso. They don't see. He also doesn't have a wand. What? But it shows him having a wand. I don't remember it showing him having one. During the battle? the back look it shows him and hmm. him having a battle on the back oh you're right it did but it he definitely doesn't have a wand what nope. are you this, this must be a lie this this has to be a lie there's no way he would not have a wand have you what if this is his wand this is the old time he wants yeah it is sit down please I'm searching for the wand. Down, we please. have to find the wand. Look at the wand. So, yes, so for whatever reason, Neville and Luna didn't come with wands. I'm not sure what Draco's Neville wand looks and like. Luna? Draco and Luna? I thought he said no. Neville didn't come with a wand either, did he? He did. Oh, that's weird. How come the servant comes with the wand, but not the wizard? I don't know. Well, he's still a wizard. Where, where's the other half to this? To what? I don't know, buddy. What if it... Maybe there's not another half. Whoa. Oh, side comparison piece. I don't think that was on the box. I know, but like it was a size comparison piece. Yes, for the Hogwarts castle. Mm-hmm. Oh, I figured it out. I figured it out. <laughs> so, it turns out that it's not that they're missing your other color. But don't worry, I figured it out. It's supposed to be one-sided. Okay, I need you to stop, please. They're it's supposed to be weird-sided today. Okay, you're right. And here it is. You think that that's how it's going to go? Just the one side? Yes. Okay. So now. Can I see the box, please? Sure. My box. I'm going to shred it. No, you're not. It definitely sh shows him having a black wand. Huh. Maybe we'll have to get a black wand from one of our other sets as an extra to give to him. Can you double check? Judah, I'm looking at all the pieces. There's no wands. And it doesn't show him with a wand. And no other character came with a black wand. Same time. Okay, please be careful. I figured it out. Okay. Hand me one of Harry's wands. No. Can you hand me the extra Harry wand? No. Why? Not right now. We need it. But it's not Harry's wand. It's the same shade. Look. Okay. So I need the extra Harry wand. Is it this one? Shade of color. Ooh, we got a moving piece. 
A moving piece? Moving? Look, it's gonna turn. Ooh, spinny, spinny, spinny. There, buddy. This is the most difficult part of this build so far, is figuring out where this goes. Okay. Hey Dad, what's the longest one? Because like, everyone has a different size, which yeah. is the longest? I don't know, that's a good question. If you guys know, then... Well, that they showed, at least. Yeah, I I think maybe about 15 inches would be the longest. Then comment, if you guys know, then comment down below and tell us. Yeah, that'd be a good thing to comment about. Okay, so that thing spins. I don't know what goes on top of it. Wait, Dad. Oh, yes, 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 yes. Can I please build, buddy? I want to put mm -hmm. This bag has a lot more smaller pieces than the previous ones have had. Hey dad, I want to see the Battle of Hogwarts. Oh yeah? Yes. Well, maybe after we read that book. The CD to the Battle of Hogwarts. You know what? Your pops is coming to stay with us and he said that he really wants to watch oh, all the movies yeah, with I us. So maybe you can we can watch it with and him. Guys, maybe he can come into a video. I don't know if he would want to or not. He, everyone wants to. All <laughs> our fans would probably want to be yeah. to meet us live. And guys, if you want to do a live video one time, let us know. And yeah, we can do like a build contest. Oh, how cool that would that be! Like a charity contest. Ooh. Would the charity be for us? No, it would be for Charity. Is my name Charity now? No. <laughs> okay, sticker number eight. Still quite a few stickers. I don't know. Guys, I just want to do a live stream or something. Yeah, we could do a live stream sometime. If you guys want us to, that is. Yep. And then we could see all your awesome comments, and maybe we could do some, like, I yeah. don't know. Give us a like if you want us to do a live stream sometime. If we get, um, a thousand likes on this video, and... Maybe not a thousand. I think that that's too high of a goal. Um, a hundred? No. We could try for a hundred. Likes on this video, or any video, actually. Then we will do a live stream. Yeah, give us a thumbs up for a live stream. Episode. On any video. On any video. So, if you guys, if you guys want to talk to us in person, then that would be awesome. Yeah, it would be awesome. What would we build for a live stream? Maybe, like, we could build, I just, maybe do some mock builds. I have actually yeah. a ton of mock builds. Want to see them all, guys? Not right now. We did do one mock build video, and that was quite a bit of fun. Do you remember? Oh, yeah. With, for the Disney, we had to build something from each of, uh, that represents each of our characters. I did a giant slingshot, my, slingshot. Yep. Micah did um, a Christmas tree, and you did a um, snow castle. Yeah, it was pretty cool. Sadly, mine's like the only one that stayed together, though, because I locked it away safe oh, yeah. from people. I think I put mine, I think I tore mine down. Yeah, yours was torn down. 
And then Micah's um, was just put in a Lego box. Like, not, like, just put back with, like, the green in our Lego box. So. Now, when we built the big Hogwarts castle, we did um, a roof like this as well. And if you guys want us to do another one of those, but with Harry Potter, oh, how cool would that be when, with the next Harry Potter, like, minifigure line? Mm -hmm. Maybe yeah. comes out we could do that. That yeah. would be so cool. Yeah, that would be cool. Okay, why is that not going in? Because you're doing it wrong. How am I doing it wrong? I don't know. You're just doing it wrong. Otherwise, it would be there we go. in by now. Okay. I don't think it's supposed to go underneath those, though. Oh, Pop. Dad, yeah. look. It looks like it's supposed to go like this. There we go. That one. Looks like this is supposed to go like this. Maybe. According to the box. Maybe. Maybe you're right. Anyways, um, I'm just gonna you. Okay, can you stop, please? I wanna. I wanna. I wanna. You can place all the minifigures when we're done building. Soccer. Now he did trick someone into thinking that they had drinking the liquid luck so that they would do better at Quidditch. Who? Ron. Did he actually do it? No, he just made Ron believe that he did. I know, but like, did Ron win the Quidditch match? Yep, he sure did. Looks like you don't need liquid luck to become. No, nope. you know what? If you're actually good at something, you don't need luck. You just need to believe in yourself. Yes. Wait, did Harry drink the liquid up luck? He did eventually, yes. For what purpose? To get Professor Slughorn to tell him something. Oh, so he would be lucky to do that? Mm hmm. That is smart. Yep. Saving up your liquid luck. I would use half a cup for half of this for Ron and then the other half for him. Well, I think how much of it you drink depends on how long you have the luck for. Oh. So, wait, does the liquid luck still have effect even with a trick? Yeah. So how did Harry trick him? Did he take a bottle and then, um... He stole his drink at breakfast and made sure that Hermione saw him do it. So that her... And then he put the liquid left into his pocket and gave Ron the drink. And then Hermione went, Ron, you can't drink that. And then he drank it down. And, and then afterwards, Hermione said, that's... After they won the game, Hermione said, you're, that's cheating, you know? And he goes, I don't know what you're talking about. And pulls it out and shows her that he didn't use it. Wait, it is? It would be cheating? Probably, yeah. Ron, no, you can't do that. That's cheating. No. It's too late. Let him go. Wait, so... Who... No, we don't have a Ron in the set, do we? Do we have a Ron? Yeah, we do have a Ron. Okay. Wait, who did he steal the drink from? Um... 
He didn't steal it from me. He stole it from Ron. But it was Ron's drink. Then how would he make it the same color? Well, the liquid luck would just dissolve into the drink. So he he did drink the liquid luck. No. Uh, I'm so confused. He just tricked him into thinking that he did. So he like turned the drink his drink yellow? He didn't have to change the color of the drink. Okay, that's <laughs> so confusing. Like, the liquid luck doesn't make the drink a different color. I know. But like, wouldn't Harry need a colored drink to um trick Harry like the same color as the liquid luck? No. Because he's pouring it into another drink. Like, if I poured something into your milk, the milk's not going to change color unless it's something that would make the milk change color. So if I put water in your milk, you wouldn't know that there was water in your milk. Because it's not going to change the color of the milk. So the liquid milk wasn't actually lucky? Basically, is what you're saying? No, I'm saying it doesn't change the color of whatever you pour it into. Then how did he trick Ron into thinking he was drinking the liquid luck? Never mind, buddy. Never mind. Did he use butterbeer? No. Okay, we're going to put sticker number 11 on here. I would... Which is, what is that? It's gonna, I think it's like a portrait of the cosmos. It's like two stick people I'm and then making, something else. I don't I'm know. I'm making this castle lucky. Maybe it is constellations? I don't know. That's Dad, weird. I'm making this castle lucky. Okay. Look at this. I think the castle's already pretty lucky. No, it's not. Okay. It, do you know, do you remember the history it's had? Remember that? No. I haven't read Hogwarts a history like Hermione. No, I mean this one. Oh, this is that scroll thing. Oh. Remember that? Yeah, but that? Yeah. I'm talking about like this, this, like, this castle has had very unfortunate... Oh, our, our actual one that we built. Yeah, so yes. I'm making it lucky. Probably a good plan. I'm making it lucky by taking the container of liquid luck and pour and, and, make, and filling up it up in replacement for the gasoline for the castle to move. So now the castle has enough luck to last forever. Because Sounds pretty good. Because as long as I have the liquid luck, it since it's Lego, um, it will just last forever. Okay, there's the scroll. It's in that pose. <laughs> okay, Judah, we're gonna forever. do. Where's the cone? Forever. Okay. This actually has something different on it. Hmm. Look at this. It's got something inside Look of it. Look at what? Cone. I don't know what you're talking about. Okay. I didn't put anything inside of it. I'm not saying you did. I'm saying, look, it built something inside of it. What? Oh no! I didn't mean for the purple one to come out. Oh no! And all the man drinks! <laughs> oh no, now we're all paralyzed. that I just sent flying? Right there. I know. Okay. What are you looking for? 
the purple. Oh, okay. Judah, come on up here. Let's finish building, and then we'll find it here in a minute, okay? Okay. Three number eights on here. Ooh, you almost done. Almost. I'm gonna think twice. Before dumping everything out. Yes. Yeah, let's not do that anymore. I'm gonna try to. There, no. Okay, there is the last of the stickers. supposed to go down in there but it keeps causing it to fly off instead okay okay let's fly you okay it's supposed to go down in there further than that apparently 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 okay. can i put you sorry you can put it on the castle it goes on right yeah, here yeah, yeah. rubber thing. It's really weird. And this goes, I think this is that gyroscope looking thing. Don't you think? Yeah, maybe. Okay. I need to attach her. Comment down below if you guys spins. know what that is. I think it's a gyroscope. It's a gyroscope. It's a thing that keeps things from turning over. What do you mean turning over? Like something with a gyroscope in it can't fall over. It keeps things balanced. Oh, so like it can't like fall off? Yeah. So like if I put something sideways ways on it, it wouldn't fall? Right. Okay, that's probably the most unmagic thing of them all, right? I think so. Like, yeah, magnetics. I think did this that. is the telescope. Mag I've seen magnetics do that with a pen. Yeah.
We got the telescope. So where's that cage part? Cage part? Yeah, you know that Malfoy was... Oh, found it. I want in that sort of party. Party. Okay. Then this sits... Hang on, buddy. On top of here. What? Like this. It's sure not come pen down all the way to over here. It's missing. It's not. Okay. There we go. Okay. Now it's on. Okay, and then this right here attaches on. Oh man, let's have it come in. to this right here. Like that. So it's time for the review. I think just about. And then that shows to be attached on right there like that. Okay, we are done building. These are all Whee! extra pieces. So, uh, oh, no. that was cool. all right, so here we are. We are mission complete. I'm gonna turn it around so you can see all the signs right here. We've got the table thing. And we're gonna show all this closer here in a second in the review. But here it is completed. That's that sticker up and it's really bothering me, but looks pretty amazing so what we're going to do right now is i'm going to have judah grab all the mini figures i'm going to hand them to him so that we can do a review of this okay are you ready to move into the review phase yes all right let's First, start let's with do the one less well let's start with the with the castle itself first, okay? So let's start with this table here. As you can see, it has several different items on it. It's got the cupcakes, it's got the cookies, it's got the waffles, it's got the chocolate fountain. It's a pretty cool little piece. Um, we've got the mandrakes in the greenhouse in here. And we've got scissors for clipping their um, leaves which hurt? is an important part of the story note we've got the japanese lantern tree thing right here we've got um oh we missed a minifigure we've got slughorn's kind of office slash living space we've got the ravenclaw room up here which has a bookcase in it and inside of it uh, let's see if i can get that out i don't think i can is the uh divination book and then the um boy who lived um Daily Prophet tile. Yeah, that's not important, though. Yeah. Then we've got the gyroscope up here that turns. And we've got the telescope up here that we can turn and bend uh, up in the astronomy tower. And here we've got that place that Draco was looking out from. There's some really cool little details on this castle, like these things right here. And then the dragons on the, um, on the greenhouse here. This scroll is a cool little detailed piece. Um, the fact that you can see the gyroscope from the other side looking in. We've got these pieces that move a little bit on the roof here. Hey, Dad. We've got letters. We've got a couple different letters. We've got a black broom. This door right here opens and closes. We've got the liquid luck. We've got the dragonfly bottle. Uh, we've got the advanced potion making book with it. So all in all, some pretty cool stuff here on the castle itself. And so with the- So that if um, I got a giant gyroscope and just did a cream pose, I would never fall. Well, it would always keep correcting, yep. The table's pretty cool. All right, what figure do you want to, oh. We've got open wing head wing. I think this is our, like, our fourth one. Is that yeah. right? Something like that? Not that so, new, no. So something that's pretty new, but it's been in quite a few sets. All right, which one's next, buddy? Um, the wandless. The wandless. Luna Lovegood. She's in like a purple dress with black pants. Uh, sh her dress is kind of shimmery. She's got the long blonde hair piece. She does have kind of a, I don't know, surprise face and then a pleasant face. A pleasant? Yeah. Not like happy, but like pleasant. 
Um, I, I she does not that. have a wand so or any other accessories, so that is Luna there. Used to be wandless. Uh, here we have Draco Malfoy in his school robes. A lot of green details. The robes go down onto the legs. It's a pretty cool piece. He did not come with a wand. We used one of Harry's wands. Here he's got kind of a smirk, and then here he's got kind of an angry face. And then he's got his blonde, blonde hair. The shield guy. Okay. Here we've got Neville Longbottom with a server's tray and a glass. Neville did come with a wand. Um, he's in a server's what? outfit, and it looks like it's got like a money sign on the pocket there. Money, money, and money. There's a little bit of detail on the back there. He's got the brown hair piece. He's got a pretty happy face on this side, and then kind of almost like a surprised happy face on the back side. Um, so that is Neville. Jubbly, it's gonna be the... After... The last one's gonna be the trio. Okay, so who's next? All right, Professor Slughorn. And Professor Slughorn also has a little bit of shine to his torso piece. The gold kind of sticks out. He's got the, the waistcoat clip. He's got a bow tie. A lot of really cool details on that torso piece. The legs have no details. He's got the light brown wand, the gray hair piece. He's got the wrinkle lines on his face. He's got a smiley face on this side and then kind of a unpleasant, not mad face, but just not real happy face on the back side. So that is Professor Slughorn. Next up is Lavender Brown, and she is wearing a very sparkly silver necklace that shines on her and a purple legs. She's also got the pink bow. Uh, the hairpiece also, as we showed earlier, has a spot in the top for an additional accessory. Uh, so there's two accessory places on that hairpiece, and then she's got a, kind of a happy face and then a very unhappy face. Uh, and she's got the same light brown wand. So that is lavender brown. And next is probably the most unneeded of the trio. <laughs> Up next is Hermione in a pink dress. She, her shoes are very shiny, silvery shoes. Her hairpiece is a solid piece, unlike the uh, lavender brown and the um, Luna Love Good. It's plastic. Um, she's got almost a smile on this side and then a very angry face on this side. Lots of cool little details on her. Uh, she doesn't have any shimmer pattern on her dress, just the silver shoes, okay? Next is Ronald Weasley in his green sweater. Um, he was not at the party, so he's not dressed up for it. He's got he kind of an orange wand. He's got pleasant face and then a pretty unpleasant face there with his shorter, uh, I guess it's kind of longer orange hair for this one. So there is oh, Ron. Her wand was just a little bit crooked, guy. Gotcha. And then finally, we have Mr. Mm -hmm. Harry James Potter himself. And he is in some dress robes with a red shirt and tie underneath. Uh, he's got his wand, he's got his star, he's got a somewhat smiley face on this side and then a somewhat mad face on this side. Um, with this hair piece, it's kind of hard to see his scar, but otherwise a pretty cool Harry. They all have the longer legs because they're all much older at this point. They're not younger. And that's the whole set. I love this set. I can't wait to hook it on to the Whomping Willow. And then we have a couple more of these to do. Wait, and then, shouldn't we hook it on right now? No, we're gonna, once we've done all four, we're gonna hook them all together. Oh, okay? I feel like we should have done it step by step, but okay. Okay. All right, so that is this set. Did you like it? Yeah. It's pretty cool. All right, until next time. Happy building. Happy building, everyone.